Welcome to Face It Net once again. Today, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to install GoFish, the phishing framework, on a Kali Linux. So, to do that, we first go to gofish.com um, to download the, the framework. So, click on download. So, when you click the file download, um, that will take you to the GitHub and you can go down here to find out the version that you wanted to use on your system so there are different built versions available so you can pick based on your operating system you can pick the version so in my case i have downloaded the 64-bit linux version under the downloads i have got the 64-bit one so to do this um i don't want to run this from uh, downloaded for folder so i've just moved them to a uh, documents folder i'm going to extract the file from here to this folder so the file is being extracted so now we have the gofish file right. right now what we have to do is this is sort of a like pre-built file all you have to do is just run the application so here we have the configuration file this is where the configurations are kept if you open up this file you can see this is running on the local host with port number 3333 and this is exposed to internet right uh, you can access this service from internet through port number 80 and this has got the default um, certificate um, called example.cert uh, but in another video we will come back and create our own self-signed certificate to um, protect the services right so since it's running on HTTPS we will build our own certificate right so let me close this um, I'll go to the terminal so you can right click here and you can open the terminal here so that you don't need to change the paths and all the first task is you have to change the gofish permission to execute so to do that I'm going to do a command sudo change mode or ch mode right plus X execution more MOD plus X go fish hit enter and enter the password of your machine right back so we have changed the path um, the permission to execute and all you have to do is just run the command so to do just go backslash type go fish and hit enter right so now the service is running all you have to do is you have to go to the url given here so this is on the local host so you can go and type here the local host ip address https colon dash dash local host semicolon triple three and it's asked you to or uh, it's provide the potential security risk because it's running on your a default certificate i'll accept the set risk and continue now it's going to ask you to enter the password username and password by default they had the username as admin and the password was gofish but in this new build uh, which is 0.11 they changed the model to have a default password so the default password is no more gofish default password is given to you for the very first time when you run the application so go back to here the application and when you go down here you will see the default password it's given here see the very first time login with the username and password here the password is right here is the password right, i'm going to copy this password copy and enter it here paste and click sign in there you go it's asking to reset your password give your password wrong and click save password uh don't save it here that's it now we are in gofish dashboard here we have the various options we can create campaigns we can create users and groups and we can create email templates landing page so landing page is where when you send a, a phishing email um, when someone click on the url that will have to redirect to a page so that's what the landing page so we can create the landing page the good thing is these there are options to even simulate import the landing page so we don't need to create everything a to z you can just say which landing page you want import the url that it will create it so we will go ahead and create a email campaign to do a phishing attack on another video so in this video 
I'll just show you guys how to install or set up the GoFish on a Kali Linux. Thanks for watching. Uh, do subscribe to Face It Net in YouTube. Thanks.